hit, uh, struck one from the road. He just gobbled again, didn't he? I think he got. So we're on our way up to see if we can get one. Mother's Day. Um, Sydney slept in this morning. I hunted New Hampshire for a little while. Saw a couple bear, heard a few turkeys. Picked her up about nine at the house. Went and grabbed a bite to eat and checked a few spots. I'd roosted a bird up here a few days ago, but never got a chance to hunt it. Somebody else was already here. Um, but today I stopped and said, I think I told you that I'd roosted one up in here. I hit a turkey call and he gobbled up on top. It's really steep to get up in here. So we took the scenic route uh, up around and came up abo uh, above him and hit a call and he hammered back. Uh, he kind of came around the, the knoll. I don't know if I got all this on film or not. I'm not even sure what I got for the shot yet, but he came around the, the knoll over to our left here, poked his head up around, either saw something he didn't like or he wasn't happy with that approach.
approach and ended up coming back up through. There's a break in the stone wall. Um, came through that break, went to full strut or three quarter strut, and then uh, Sydney was able to get a shot at him and took it, and she's tagged out now in Vermont. Two weekends in a row, a Saturday yeah. and a Sunday. So. Yeah. That's all you gotta say. When when was the last time I tagged out? I don't know that you've ever tagged out in Vermont. You've shot turkeys in Vermont on weekends. I don't think weekend. I've ever tagged out either. This is her first time tagging out in Vermont. Um, she's still working on her first. It solo doesn't hunt, have a beard. But it, yeah, it's beard rot. Has beard rot, but we'll Where show you it? the spurs too. Uh, go ahead, hold those, pick it up, hold the spurs up to the camera. Get some decent hooks on them. She played the game right, and she made a good shot on them. Pretty decent spurs, but no beard. I can't really. How do I show that? Just right there. No beard. <laughs> but it's been a good season. We've had some luck. We've had some hard days, so the ones, the days that it's uh, worked out for us, um, uh, makes it all the more rewarding. And I, I would say the mid to late mornings have been better than off the roost hunts. I did have that one really good off the roost hunt um, in Vermont myself last week, Wednesday, and then. Uh, the one I missed, he came in gobbling hard mid-morning. And then this one, like I said, we, we hit him, we struck him from the road. It takes a little bit of effort to get here. And uh, I guess it was worthwhile. And um, tagged out. Now I'm gonna slowly work on my second bird. And we may get a New Hampshire license for Sydney so she can still try, try to, to pursue solo. her solo hunt here, so. Yeah. But, gotta love May. <laughs> the weather still hasn't been great, but we're, no. we're hanging in there, scratching away. Yesterday I hunted with the father-son first-time hunters, and uh, we had one close. I didn't try to get that one on film. Um, I was just concentrating on trying to get, help them get their first turkey. And we had one within 15 to 20 yards just on the other side of a stone wall and no matter what we tried to do we could not get him to poke his head up over and then uh, when we tried to poke our head back up over it didn't really work out so but again been pretty good <sighs> seen a few good hunts they're all good but wrapping up the hunt here Took a few minutes to enjoy uh, the moment. No big rush right now to get on the next one. So I uh, stood up here. This is a spot that I've shot a lot of turkeys off from. I've brought other people up here and other people have shot turkeys. And now Sydney can uh, put a check mark on this uh, little spot. It's one of my uh, go-to. It had been one of my go-to spots for a long time. And then I've kind of moved on. But it's nice to revisit it and take the scenic route up here and have it work out so happy Mother's Day and uh, we got a Mother's Day turkey dinner I guess to prepare <laughs>